So here's an old A6 compressor. Oh, nice and tight. Must have been a new rebuild. Yeah, it looks pretty damn new. Just has rust on it because we're by the ocean. Check out the size of that receiver on there. Actually, that's a discharge muffler. Wait a minute, that's a suction muffler? No, that's a, that is a receiver discharge muffler before it goes into the top of the condenser. Here's the liquid line coming out. They got a modern, this is a, to get rid of the old VTR, VRFD, God damn, I forgot the name of it. Um, it has like an expansion valve and a POA device all in one thing, a VIR assembly. Damn, I can't even remember. My dad used to have me rebuild them when I was a kid. But they get rid of that and they replace it with this little tube and turn it into a simple cycling system. So you got a low pressure cycling here. Here's your oil return. And I think they're going to put an accumulator in replace onto this. So they're converting it over to an accumulator. Looks like they got a new evaporator. And... uh smaller parallel style one yes and uh, too bad it didn't have a, fi a tighter fin count they can uh, make it a little more efficient um doing a little modification there you know old expansion valve oh wait a minute oh, yeah, that's right they're not turning it into an orifice tube system this is going to be the safety for the low side and it is staying an expansion valve system. Don't get to see many of these no more. Dying breed. And your old air box system right here to go to your heater core or see there's the heater core right there. That's the heater core and the air will be over there. So this flaps. It'll open one way for heater and the other way for the air conditioning. Carburetors. How many of you guys know what carburetors are anymore? Almost nobody touches those anymore. Nice new thermal fan clutch. No problem with airflow for the condenser. Did they get a modern condenser? Uh, no, it's the old tube and fin. Too bad. Uh, and there's the big, big ass receiver dryer. Look at that receiver dryer. It goes all the way up to here, all the way down here. That's a humongous receiver dryer for now uh, to nowadays specification. And uh, that would be like an old R12 receiver dryer. Uh, so they have that on there. I would convert this to parallel flow though. I would not stick with the old 3 8 So this is old 3 8 tube and fin, but instead of being made, made out of uh, copper tubes, they got aluminum tubes with aluminum fins. Interesting, okay. Oh, this, uh, I hope I'm around when they put this together. I want to see this. They do their own AC here. It looked like it was 12, and they put retrofit fittings on it. This is old air products. Hmm. I'd like to see this one up and running. This is what I grew up as a kid. My dad taught me to rebuild these, and he would sell them. And we'd rebuild them in the house in the garage. All right, guys, I'll see you.